guys, I just got back to my Japanese Airbnb and I'm really interested in showing you guys, just giving you guys a tour because every time I stay out in town, stay out in Japan, I always go for Airbnbs. They're cheaper, they're really easily accessible, all the hosts that I've ever stayed with have been really, really helpful and I don't know, they, I just like Airbnbs better than hotels. Alright, so I just got into the door and pretty much in all Japanese houses it kind of has this little area where you can take off your shoes because it's polite not to wear your shoes around the house. So now I got my little slippers on so I'm good to walk around the house and I'm going to start by showing you this laundry room slash bathroom area. So I've been provided with towels I've been provided with a lot of linen. I have things to clean up the room. And then down here I have some more laundry detergent. I've actually already done a couple loads of laundry today. This Airbnb is super helpful. They've actually got all the directions right here just to show me how to automatically wash everything. So this is just a washer so you can just lift it up and place your clothes down inside. So I'll show you guys what I'm working with. So I've got some of my pants hanged up and one of the towels that I use to shower and another pair. And up here it actually has heat and a drying component that comes through to help dry everything that's hung up. So yeah, this is my little shower area. And then excuse the mess, but I got my stuff in here. So it's pretty basic in here. Just a toilet, some cleaning products, some extra wipes to clean the seat. So I've got my stuff sitting out, but then we have my nice little bed over here. And then I'll open this up just so you guys can see my little view. So right now I'm actually staying in Namba. I'm really close to the Namba metro station. And it's a really nice location. I think it's pretty close to a lot of the things that I like to do. Um, yeah, I got my luggage out here. And then I also have this nice little kitchen. One burner right here. But they have extra pots and pans in the storage area. Cupware. I have a nice little mini fridge and freezer. The microwave. And it's super cute little vanity so I can do my makeup in the mornings. Hey, how are ya? And here's my TV with Wi Fi and everything. I've even got a little sitting area. Just got to Universal Studios. Oh my god, they have a Bubba Gum Shrimp! Okay. Yeah, definitely gonna hit that. <laughs> Mel's Burgers. I just got the barbecue bacon burger. Thank you. I'm not 
次の感染中事故も、うまくなさらないしているように、ライブには何も持ち込むことができません。Guys. Public transportation is really not hard in Japan, especially since a lot of the options always have English. Look how beautiful this is. I'm just taking it all in right now. Everyone's enjoying their day at the park. It's really nice. So I want to get up in there. I think this is the entrance where you pay for tickets. I think on the website it said it was only 600 yen, so it's really cheap to do a castle tour. And I want to get alert today. Really good. So, one thing that's really awesome is that they sell these things called bento boxes. And you can open them up and start eating them on the shin because a lot of time they only provide small snacks on the shin and sometimes your rides can be a little bit long so it is good to get some food in so here are some of the bento box choices and you can pick them up right here and then pay around the corner i couldn't find the ones that i originally wanted but this one has some sushi rolls in it so i'm about to open it up for you guys so you guys can check that out <laughs> 